Whitsy, thanks for joining us. Can you talk us through why we're here today? Yeah, so I've been lucky enough to sign on for another five years. Um, super excited about it. There's no hesitation and I'm just so glad it's done so now I can get to work. You moved up uh, to the Gold Coast at the end of 2016 and quickly became a well-respected leader of the club. What has that meant to you? Um, well, initially I just came up to try and get a game and uh, get some continuity um, around my game and, and being able to do that, I initially sort of just I was able to build build on that and, then, and the leadership sort of grew from there. So, um, yeah, it's just something that I feel like has come, a bit, come naturally and I've still got a long way to go in that area though. Did that play a big part in you putting pen to paper? Um, yeah, definitely. I think I've got a, a bit to offer this group and I love um, working with all the boys and especially now that we've got such a young group, I feel like I can have a bit of an influence over that. Yeah, no. What's been your favourite memory on the Gold Coast so far? Um, I think when we beat the Swans last year, that was huge. So I really enjoyed that game, playing in front of family and friends and yeah, that's one of my favourite moments so far. And we're at a pretty good spot today. Do you have any uh, personal favourite places on the Gold Coast where you like to spend your downtime? Yeah, pretty much just right behind us. Um, I live about 400 metres inland from here, so um, this is where I come most afternoons, so it's a great spot, as you can see. Yeah. Do you have any hobbies? No, not really. A bit of golf and, and spending most of my time at the beach, so that's pretty much me there. And you've uh, just gotten engaged to your partner, Renee. How has she supported you through your career? Yeah, she's been massive. She's followed me since so she came from Melbourne. Um, she came to Melbourne, sorry, from Sydney. And then obviously from Melbourne up to, hit, up to the Gold Coast. So um, she's been a huge support for me over my journey um, and career. And I'm looking forward to, we just got recently got engaged. So yeah, looking forward to the future and what's to come there. Just finally, what do you look forward to most this coming season? Uh, I, I think I've, when games come around, that's probably the most the thing I'm looking forward to the most. We've done a lot of hard work over the last couple of months and everyone's put in really hard. But um, yeah, obviously here to play games and, and I'm looking forward to round one. Great, thanks for your time, yeah, Woodsy. Congratulations. Thanks very much.